Hi, I'm Mike, founder of GoodBed.com. Today we're going to take you through the Sealy Posturepedic Plus Hybrid Collection, which is the most premium collection of hybrid mattresses that Sealy makes. So we're excited to show it to you. Stick around. So before we dive into the specific details of this collection, I just want to give you a quick lay of the land as to where this collection fits within the broader Sealy product portfolio. Sealy organizes its products into three levels, uh, kind of a good, better, best that they call Essentials, Posturepedic, and Posturepedic Plus. So we're talking about the products that are at the highest level. And then within each of those three uh, levels, they, they have three different types of products. They have Innerspring, Foam, and Hybrid. So we're talking really mostly in this video about the hybrid portion of that highest level. Now, the other thing I would, should point out is that within the Posturepedic Plus level, the hybrid and the foam portions of those products are designed really in parallel with one another. So we're gonna cover the foam products in a separate video, but we're gonna talk a little bit about them in this video because the uh, products at, at each level within Posturepedic Plus hybrid collection, there are kind of sister or brother products that are in the foam collection, and in some cases, if you are looking for a specific feel of firm or soft or more memory feel or less memory feel, you might want to be looking in the brother or sister collection on the foam side uh, rather than in the Posturepedic Plus hybrid side. So we'll talk a little bit about that in this video, but we'll also cover those in more detail in a separate video. All right, so getting into the details of what's actually in these Posturepedic Plus hybrid mattresses, let's start with the features that they all have in common because there are actually five total models in this collection. Uh, so it, let's start with just the aesthetics. They're all going to use kind of a, a dark gray aesthetic in general, kind of charcoal, bold coloring. They're all going to use kind of a waterfall edge on the top here There's, and, and a surface that has no quilting on it. So it's always a stretch cover uh, with no quilting and then a waterfall edge going off the side as opposed to a tape edge that you might find on a more traditional mattress or, or for that matter in the Sealy Posturepedic Plus Innerspring uh, collection. So that's one of the things that you're going to find actually in both the hybrid uh, and the foam versions of the Posturepedic Plus collection. Uh, going to the insides of the mattress, uh, what you're going to find is not exactly the same coil unit in all of them, but all of them are going to have at least uh, a 1072 coil count uh, in a queen size. They're all going to use pocketed coil construction. They're all going to have uh, what they call the Duraflex Edge Pro, uh, which is basically a couple rows of smaller diameter, stronger coils going around the perimeter of the mattress that helps give the mattress a stronger edge. And what the Pro signifies in Sealy's parlance is that the fabric encasement going around those two rows of edge coils has perforations in it just to add to add a little bit more airflow to the inner spring portion of the mattress. But uh, even just the very, the very fact that the edge support in this mattress is coming from edge coils as opposed to foam encasement, that in itself already kind of provides, I think, uh, quite a bit of added airflow through the spring layer of these mattresses. Above those coils, you're going to find mixed amounts of memory foam uh, and other foams. You're going to find generally at least about an inch and a half of total memory foam in these hybrids, uh, a little bit more in the foam uh, sisters and brothers that are in this collection. And then you're going to find at least one to two inches of what they call comfort sense memory foam, which is uh, what the name that Sealy reserves for its most premium memory foams, its highest density memory foams. These are memory foams that are at least two and a half pounds density or more. Uh, and just in general, these are the ones that they, they believe provide the best pressure relief and, and so forth. And that comfort sense layer is always going to be right up at the top so that you can get the most benefit from it. So right underneath this stretch cover. And again, with the lack of quilting, that means that the memory foam is really close to your body essentially to maximize the pressure relieving benefit that you would get from it. Uh, and then right up on the top, another thing that all of these uh, Posturepedic Plus hybrid mattresses are going to have in common is you're going to find some, some uh, a cooling feature in the cover, which is uh, achieved through the use of polyethylene fibers in the cover. Uh, that PE fiber, that what that does is it's just a higher molecular weight yarn that essentially means that it's denser and things that are denser tend to have kind of more of a coolness. I, I like to use the analogy of uh, the difference between lying down on a marble table versus a wood table. You know, if you can imagine that marble 
table would generally feel very much cooler than the wood table because of its higher density. So it's similar with this, with this P, uh, polyethylene fiber in these covers, which is actually all the gray, the dark gray here is with the polyethylene fiber. That is going to give you some coolness to the touch right up near your body. And another feature of these covers that all the Posturepedic Plus hybrid mattresses are gonna have in common is what Sealy calls surface guard, which is the use of uh, an antimicrobial uh, uh, treatment on, this, on these covers. In fact, this is something that they use throughout the Posturepedic uh, collection, even we've talked about it in other videos that cover those products. But uh, so that's something you're also going to find here. And then the last thing I would note too, that is again, something not unique to this level, but uh, probably true of anything on the posturepedic level and above is that these mattresses are all adjustable base compatible. So meaning you're free to use them and they're designed to be used on an adjustable base. All right, so now let's switch gears to take a look at the specific models in this Posturepedic Plus hybrid collection. And we'll start with the one I'm on right here, which is the base level model. It's called the Albany Medium. It's a 13 inch mattress. This is a model that has that coil unit I described. It's the 1072 coil unit that Sealy calls the Response Pro HD. And I should note that uh, that is a step up in coil count from what you find at the top of the Posturepedic hybrid collection, which again, we cover in a separate video. Uh, but that's the collection right below this one. That one tops out uh, at 903 coils. That's what they call their Response Pro coil unit. Response Pro HD, HD standing for higher density, refers to the fact that there's a higher density of coils in this coil unit being the 1072. So uh, that's the coil unit you're talking about. You, in this model, you've got about an inch and a half of total memory foam, including one inch of that Comfort Sense, more premium memory foam up at the very top. Overall, we would characterize this one as a medium firm on our softness spectrum. Uh, so just a little to the firmer side of medium. And we'd say though it has about average cushioning depth. And I should note at this point that when Sealy refers to softness levels in the names that they give the products, um, typically what they are more referring to is how much cushioning depth, how, how deeply you sink in, how much the mattress conforms to your body. Whereas when we refer to softness, we refer to that attribute as cushioning depth. Uh, and we refer to softness as more just like the actual kind of surface softness that you feel when you first uh, make contact with the mattress. So on the softness level, we classify it as a medium firm, but as it relates to the cushioning depth, we would say this is right average cushioning depth, kind of right in the middle, which, which kind of aligns with Sealy's calling this a medium. Uh, as it relates to the amount of memory feel, there's an inch and a half of memory foam, as I mentioned. Uh, overall, uh, we would say there's slightly more than average amount of memory feel in this mattress. I mean, it's not an overwhelmingly large amount of memory foam, so, uh, but it is rather slow responding memory foam. So you get maybe a little bit disproportionately much uh, memory feel, but still just a little more than average, recognizing that these days, most mattresses, <laughs> it's the average mattress at least, has some memory foam in it. So the middle uh, of that spectrum, uh, as far as how much memory feel is in a mattress is not zero, it's, it's, it's some. So slightly more than average. And then of course, uh, this is a spring mattress, so it does have a little bit of bounce. Uh, that being said, that bounce, you only really feel it if you plop your full weight down. Uh, there's no real surface bounce where, there's, where you're only touching the memory foam and there's not really a whole lot of mid-level bounce because there's enough foam on top that shock absorbs uh, any kind of mid-range impact. But when you do get into bed, you'll notice that there's some, some spring in the mattress. So overall, we'd say kind of an average amount of overall bounce in this mattress. And the last thing I'll add about this Albany medium mattress is that it does, as I mentioned earlier, that Sealy has designed the hybrid, Posturepedic Plus hybrid collection in conjunction with the Posturepedic Plus foam collection. And so there are two sibling models to the Albany. They have the Albany firm and the Albany soft that are in the Posturepedic Plus foam collection. We're gonna show you those in a separate video, but I just wanted to let you know that they do exist. They are the same height, the same price point. So if you're looking for a mattress that at this price point and you're looking for a slightly different feel than what you find in the Albany, whether in terms of different amount of softness or memory feel or different amount of bounce, then you could check out the Albany Firm or Soft as well. All right, so now we've moved up within the Posturepedic Plus Hybrid Collection to kind of the next level. So they have sort of three levels. There's a good, better, and best even within the Posturepedic Plus Hybrid. Uh, Albany was the good, 
This level is called the Brenham, and then we'll get to the high point, which is the, the top of the line within the Posturepedic Plus Hybrid collection. The Brenham has uh, a firm and a soft, the Brenham Hybrid, I should say, has a firm and a soft, and then has a, a sibling, the Brenham Medium, on the foam side of the Posturepedic uh, Plus collection. Uh, but we'll, we're not gonna show you that one in this video. We'll cover that one in a separate video. Uh, so on, as far as the Brenham Firm goes, uh, this is where the hybrid collection steps up to a slightly different coil unit. So we talked about the previous coil unit being called the Response Pro HD. Well, this is called the Response Pro Zoned HD. What that means is essentially in the center third of the mattress, they're introducing a nesting uh, to the coil system that basically allows them to get even more coils into the same amount of kind of uh, area of the mattress. So there's an even higher density of coils in that center third in order to give you a little bit more support underneath the heaviest part of your body. So that means that the total number of coils in a queen size is 1090 now up from 1072. But again, the 18 additional coils are all in this center third and they just are able to do that by nesting them together as opposed to being in just rows like this. They kind of do like a diagonal, they got everything kind of nested together diagonally so that they can fit more in there. So that's one of the differences that in this model. Another difference is this is a half inch thicker mattress. It's 13 and a half inches. And you can think of that extra half inch being an additional half inch of that comfort sense memory foam because you do get one half inch more of that. You have an inch and a half of comfort sense memory foam right up at the top of the mattress in this model. And actually you have two and a half total inches of memory foam. So the other inch of memory foam is right below the comfort sense. So you're definitely gonna get a little bit more memory feel on this than you do on the Albany that we just showed you. Still not as high, not, not as much memory feel as we'll show you in some of the models later in this video, but certainly uh, more of that than in the Albany. As far as the softness goes, uh, we would characterize this one as probably a firm on our softness spectrum, uh, but really just up towards the soft end of that firm classification, really close to a medium firm. So it's not all that much firmer than the Albany, but it, we do have, definitely think it's firmer, particularly once you get below the first couple inches. Those first couple inches are very similar to the Albany, but then the next level of memory foam adds some more firmness. Uh, as far as the cushioning depth goes, we'd probably classify this as just a little deeper cushioning than on the Albany, still just a little deeper than average is kind of how we'd, we'd put that. Uh, and in terms of the bounce, probably a little bit less bounce probably that, that you'll notice than on the Albany. Again, I think because of the additional memory foam, which just adds, even when you put your full weight down on it, it kind of absorbs just a little bit more of that impact. So resulting in a little bit of a, of a less bouncy experience on this model. All right, so now we've moved over to the sibling model, the Brenham Soft. This is going to be the same price as the Brenham Firm. Uh, it's just going to be a, a little bit different construction in order to create a little bit different feel. Still a 13 and a half inch mattress and still an inch and a half of that uh, premium comfort sense memory foam right up at the top and the same coil unit that we just described to you with the Brenham Firm. Uh, but you do get an additional half inch of memory foam in this model. So a total of three inches of memory foam in this model. And you're definitely gonna go in to get, to get a different feel on this model as well. So we would classify this as a medium on our softness spectrum, but sort of like this was at the soft end of firm, this one, uh, the Brenham Soft, is at the soft end of medium. So not quite enough to be a medium soft, but, but uh, certainly at the softer end of our medium classification. As it relates to cushioning depth, this is going to have substantially more cushioning depth than what you find on the Brenham Firm. Uh, we would classify this as very deep cushioning, so you're going to get very much that feeling of sleeping in your mattress, that hugged or cradled sensation with a lot of conformance uh, on this mattress. And as far as memory feel, because of the fact that there's an additional half inch of memory foam, you are gonna get a little bit more memory feel on this mattress, a little bit more of that slow melting, slow responsiveness feeling that memory foam is known for. And conversely, a little bit more of the impact of landing on the mattress gets absorbed by that memory foam. So just a smidge less bounce on this model as well. 
All right, so now we've moved up to the top level of the Posturepedic Plus Hybrid Collection, which are the models that you'll see under the name High Point. Uh, at this point in the video, by the way, you may have noticed that the three model names we've used, Albany, Brenham, and High Point, are each city names. Uh, the common thread there is that these are each uh, cities where Sealy has factories. So coming back to the High Point, uh, which is a city in North Carolina where one of Sealy's factories is located, this uh, level of models has uh, the firm, the hybrid firm, the hybrid soft, as well as a sister model on the foam side of the Posturepedic Plus collection called the Ultra Soft, the High Point Ultra Soft. We're not going to show you that one in this video. Uh, you'll notice that there's not a medium at this level. It may be worth noting though that Sealy's sister company, Tempur-Pedic, does make the uh, Temper Adapt Medium and the Adapt Medium Hybrid, which are kind of at a similar price point. So if you're looking for more of a medium amount of conformance and cushioning depth, uh, that sort of feel at this price point, you may wanna check that out. So now, in terms of the High Point Hybrid Firm, there are a couple of things that you're going to get at this level of the Posturepedic Plus collection. First, the coil unit that I just described with regards to the Brenham models is going to carry forward into this model. So that, that will be, remain the same. However, there are two additional cooling features at this level of the collection. One is that you're going to get more of that polyethylene fiber higher density yarn in the cover of the mattress, which will add some additional coolness to the touch. Uh, just visually, you can look at this cover and see that in this case, it's not only the gray, the dark charcoal that is that polyethylene fiber, but it's also uh, the white diamonds that contain that same fiber. So more of that. And in addition, the top layer of foam has a PCM, a phase change material applied to the top of it. So that again gives even more coolness to the touch uh, and more even beyond just the original touch, but just coolness up at the surface of the mattress. So that's it's certainly something you can feel. It's noticeable that these models have a little bit more of that. They're also a little bit taller. You're talking about now a 14 inch mattress, so an additional half inch of height. And you're also going to get an additional amount of that premium memory foam. So specifically, you're gonna, uh, in the high point firm that I'm on right here, you're talking about three and a half inches of that premium memory foam, which is an additional half inch above what you have in the Brenham Soft that we looked at just before this. And I realized, by the way, that I misspoke in, in Describing the Brenham Soft, I had indicated that not all of that memory foam was the Comfort Sense premium memory foam. In fact, it is all the Comfort Sense premium foam. So all three inches of the Brenham Soft and all two and a half inches of the Brenham Firm were Comfort Sense. And here now you have three and a half inches of that premium Comfort Sense memory foam right up at the top. So in terms of the feel of the High Point Firm, we would classify this one as about a medium on our softness spectrum as well. Uh, really kind of a similar overall amount of softness to what we showed you on the Brenham Soft. Uh, however, it's a little bit different in terms of where you find the softness. Here, there's a particularly high amount of softness right in this very top layer of memory foam, uh, whereas the next layer is a little, a little bit uh, firmer. It was a more even amount of softness in, in, in the Brenham Soft model that led to the same overall amount of softness. But nonetheless, uh, about a medium level of softness. Uh, certainly, again, above average amount of cushioning depth and conformance, more of that hugged or cradled sensation rather than a floating above your, uh, your mattress sensation. However, not as much of that conformance as you'd find on the Brenham Soft. Likewise, I'd say a similar amount of memory feel like we talked about. There's a little bit more memory feel. That being said, some of that memory foam here is a little softer. You don't necessarily tend to feel the softer memory foam as much. So on balance, about the same amount of that slow melting memory feel and a similar amount of bounce, uh, kind of a, a little bit below average amount of bounce that comes from the fact that yes, you have coils, but, but also you have these, this sort of shock absorbing memory foam above it. All right, so now we've moved to the last model in this Posturepedic Plus Hybrid collection, the High Point Soft. And in this model, all of the features that we just described are going to carry forward into this model. Really, they're going to be the same. It's still a 14 inch mattress. You still have three and a half inches of that Comfort Sense premium memory foam up at the top. You still have the same coil units. You still have those same cooling features that we just described. In terms of the feel, though, the feel is going to be a little bit different. Um, in fact, uh, this is going to be counterintuitive because this being the soft model, you'd expect it 
to be something we classify as softer on our softness spectrum. But as I explained earlier in the video, what we call softness is, doesn't necessarily correlate with the nomenclature used by Sealy. So we would actually classify this one as a firm on our softness spectrum uh, because as you can see, it has quite a bit more surface firmness, uh, which is what we are really describing in our classification of softness. That being said, what you do find here is more cushioning depth, more conformance. Uh, you're gonna sink more into it. You're gonna get more of that hugged or cradled sensation. So certainly deeper than average cushioning uh, uh, on this model. And then likewise, you're gonna get really the most amount of that kind of slow melting memory feel on this model, I'd say within the entire Posturepedic Plus hybrid collection. Uh, and maybe for the same reason, probably the least amount of bounce. You're gonna get uh, still some bounce for sure when you come down, but because of the, the fact that you have uh, the, the denser memory foam up on top, a lot of that gets absorbed and you end up with kind of a below average amount of, of overall bounciness on this mattress. So there you have it. That is the Posturepedic Plus hybrid collection from Sealy. We hope you found that to be a helpful rundown. And for more helpful information on how to find the right mattress for you, go to goodbed.com. In the meantime, thanks for watching and we really hope you sleep well.